I've made some of these up. I'll show you how to make a, how I made them up in a minute. Now to go around that. They look pretty good. All right, look all right to me anyway. Bit of varnish and that on there, and I'll run some timbers down the front shortly. That's just to stop every stuff from sliding off the top. Yeah, and I'll put you on the tripod and show you how how I done, how I done it. I'll just sand it back. It's seen me sand, so I'll just sand it all back and get it all ready, and then I'll show you. If, uh, what I did first, I nailed a piece of there, so I'll dig it off that bench, so I'll get do the same thing with this one, line it up on there, put two nails in it just to hold it, just to hold it, um, I might put you around this side so you can see a bit better. See how these, you'll be able to see that alright. They bring it off the bench so when you put this down here and it raises it up too high. But I noticed when I've done that other one a minute, I've moved a bit. So I'm going to have to readjust it, I think. I know if it's this one, if you push down too much, it, it moves it up. It moves. Yeah, it moves. Just push that down, pull it back down again. You want that flush with the bottom of that. In there, about there, about it, so put that there like that, there we go. <laughs> See that? Looks fairly good. You can see the little bit of there. Now I cut 45. I have to cut 45 in it. It's easier with this saw. Try it on. I'll put it on the back of it. As you can see, I've 
I've already done that with two, so this will go on there like that. And I'll just nail it there like that somewhere, just there. Go around the back, on the back of it. Yep, so I've got my nail going. I'm going to go around this side. This one is sixty-five, so you go down this end, you measure the same. So what I'll do, double check the measurement, away, 65, no, no, it's alright, 65, 65, 65, that's so alright, and then I have to stick a few more nails out, to hold it on there. I can't see where the nails are, I go, there you go, 65, come down 65 from the top, go right into there like that, I don't want to see where the timber is just below it. Done. Now, a pretty good edge around there, that'll do, good enough for me. I'm not a professional, but it fucking looks alright. Once I varnish it all up and everything. Now, I'll take it out of there. To do now, cut a bit of this again and run a piece down there. Down there, right to the bottom, one down there, well, yeah, one down there, one across there. I'm gonna have to go and try it in the bus first, I think. Try it in the bus and see how I go, put it in the bus first. Anyway, I'll get back to you once I'll try it in the bus. This is where it's gonna go, everyone. It's going in here, the air conditioner's going in there. That's pretty much how it's going to fit, like that, and a little shelf on top, pretend you snore and stuff on here, and I have a little hook here, so hook on the side here, but what I was doing, I just wanted to make sure how long I need these, because I want to try to get them right back here, to cover that gap, but now I know I can measure the bottom one, I'm just going to go off the bottom one down there, and just go all the way to the top, and that'll be good. That'll be good. Anyway, I'll measure it and I'll take it out and get back into it. Well, I'm going to stain this side with this stain. That's the stuff we're using. I'll show you what we're using. Whatever that says. Clear wood varnish. More coat you put on the darker this and I'll put one coat on it. And see what it looks like and then I probably only just put one coat on it. I don't want it real light. I don't want it real dark. Stain this side first, and then I'm going to mount it in there. Once I get this side stained, I'll 
And then once I mount it in there, I'll then I'll paint the rest of it, stain the rest of it. Pretty much what I have, what I'm going to do. Just just one coat. One coat like that. It's going to look good. Anyway, I'll do the whole lot and then I'll push it back where it's going to go and I'll give you this look then. Yeah, this is in there where it's going to stay, where it's going to live. I just keep giving the coat a bit varnish stuff. Make sure I get it in everywhere. See where it's going pretty dark in here, but I've still got a little timbers to put on there yet, so I'm going to do that in a little while. I'll have to get another piece of timber, I'll cut two bits of timber. This will just help protect it. Make it look a bit better. Sometimes a bit dark in here, but. Paint this, I'll give you a look at how both how screwed it in there. I hope you can see that alright. Yeah, looks 
good. I just put these L shapes, as you can see them down there. Here. L clamps there with just four screws, one on each post. One on each post I put. And once I'm finished here, I want to cut the timber for there. Now I know how wide I have, have it for the air conditioner. You won't see much of this in here because of the air conditioning here, but I'm going to paint it anyway. Do it. Do it up here. Pretty good. Looks alright. I've only put one coat on it. The more coats you get, the darker it gets. So I don't want it dark, I only want it light. I take this off the tripod. I'll take it out here, you might be able to see it a bit better out this way. That's roughly what it's going to look like. Some of this, they might have to get another coat, but some of this timber might suck a fair bit of this up, so. I'm going to wait and see how it goes, see how much they suck up, and I'll see what happens. Anyway, I'll do the other piece of timber and put the aircon in, and then I'll show you when I do that. Well, here's the cupboard all done. There you go, all done. I'll do let it dry now and get the air conditioner back in there. That's it all done. Hope you can see that alright. We've got a little latch here. We do push it up like that. Close it. That's it. Hope it will turn out alright. Turn out pretty good I reckon. Let it dry now and then get the air con, air con in there. Let it all dry now. And perfect. Looks looking good, looking good. Looking good. And this is how I'm gonna do all the kitchens down there, around there, around there's gonna be the same way as this. Go down around, around down to the bottom and across across the back. No, I like it. You can see me. Anyway, that's it for this video. I'll catch you on the next one. Bye for now.